Hey guys, Marsling in here bringing you another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video and today for the theme team battle of the day we are doing the heroes of Dragon Ball Z. So this is like a follow up to the villains of Dragon Ball Z video that I did where we made a team based on the villains only from the main Dragon Ball Z. So nothing from Dragon Ball Super or the movies. Um, trying to cover uh, the main villains from all of the arcs. Um, then our boy AC over AC Gaming, who I did a race with yesterday, so if you haven't seen that, make sure you check that out. I'll probably have that as one of the link videos at the end, so do go and check that out. But um, he did a sort of counter video to me of the... Uh, he did a Heroes video, but he included Dragon Ball Super characters and went up against the Jiren event, what with Jiren being the sort of final boss of Dragon Ball Super. So I shot him a message and said that because he'd included Super in his one, he should do a follow-up video for villains, including Super, and I would do a Heroes video that, like my original one, uh, was only for Dragon Ball Z. So... We have the Spirit Bomb Goku as the leaders. Uh, he's probably the best leader skill unit I could find that would fit the theme of the team. Um, obviously a base form Goku that does the Spirit Bomb is pretty relevant to like the whole of Dragon Ball Z. Even though the card and his 18 key super is based on the end of the Buu Saga. Uh, then we got this Tech Kaioken Goku who obviously defeated Vegeta. He gets an awakening in the four year but he's very solid. I've had him rainbow for a little while. Then we got the Rage Super Saiyan Goku to represent the end of the Freezer arc. Unfortunately, we don't have the new transforming one from JP, who would obviously be the ideal guy to put in this slot. Um, although, technically, I guess we actually we wouldn't be able to use him, would we? Because they have the same name. But either way, we don't have him on global. So then we've got LR Gohan, obviously defeated Cell. Then we've got Ultimate Gohan, who uh, had his <laughs> five minutes of fame, was very hype. And then just got crushed by Boo. And then we have the uh, LR, Goku, and Vegeta that become Vegito, who are the main fight against Super Boo. And uh, obviously the friend as well. So that pretty much carries us from the very beginning all the way to the very end of Dragon Ball Z. So we're going to jump in. We are taking on the STR Super Boo event, since he is essentially the final boss of Dragon Ball Z. And uh, the event does tick all the way down through his uh, transformation. So I think, do we, is it is Kid Buu the final one? It might not actually, is it Kid Buu or the Buff Buu? I guess it doesn't really matter, but it's pretty fitting for the theme to uh, end up fighting this Buu. So yeah, we're going to jump in. Obviously the uh, best unit on the team is probably the LR Vegito. LR Gohan's going to do some pretty decent damage for us. The Spirit Bomb Gokus will come in handy for healing. Um, this uh, Rage Goku is probably the worst unit on the team by a significant margin. Um, but, you know, we'll have to make do with what we've got. Um, see, I don't like this because... Can't get a super attack for you, which is a bit of a shame, but... He is probably the best tank. And as much as I don't want you on rotation... Actually, no. We'll, we should... Gohan. Gohan will get a super here. So, that's okay. It's not his 18 key. But, in fact, he gets extra key anyway. So, we might as well give him that. So, I'm going to start off using this. Just because that Goku is quite the liability. And if he gets super attacked at the end, I'll probably take a ton of damage. Because... He is very relevant, obviously, for the theme of the team, but he is a unit that I don't really use, so he doesn't have a huge amount of orb investment, and um, I don't have a ton of STR orbs, and since we are building up towards the four year, and I'm obviously very much hoping to pull LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, I don't want to use up all of my STR orbs right now, so... And of course they get the level 5 dodge on the attack after the super attack, so... Gotta love it, but... But yeah, this Boo has very, very good damage mitigation, so this uh, event will probably run a little bit long. Uh, we don't have a team quite at the level that will be able to uh, take him out before we get to the phase where his damage mitigation runs out. Because certain category teams you can bring that will just like completely overpower this event and you can take him out before, but I don't think we will quite make it there, so... The healing factor of the LR Spirit Bomb Goku there, allowing us to get back to full health. Uh, the Icarus active means that 
hopefully we don't get super attacked in the end but it means we'll take a lot less damage here uh, the reason I put mine in the end slot instead of the friend one is uh, I actually gave mine three dodge because of course I did and uh, it's very difficult to find LR Spirit Bomb Goku friends who uh, gave them three dodge but hey he's getting an additional super attack as well so there you go and a crit so so he is getting super attacked here oh look at that could you ask for anything more all three of his hidden potential abilities went off in one go. So we additional supered with a crit, then we level three dodged a super attack that would have done a significant amount of damage even with a uh, Icarus active. So that's actually awesome. I'm uh, I'm very happy with that. So okay, let's do this. Um, give you those. You can take those, and then that gives us the tech orbs for you. So, we don't have any... I don't want to use another item straight away. I'm a little bit concerned about the physical attacks on Gohan, but we are on full health, so let's go for it. Obviously, LR Vegito slash Goku Vegeta. Very, very good defensive unit. So, yeah, as you can see, no item needed. They take double digits. Uh, LR Gohan, not quite as good, especially considering mine has no dupes. Of course, of course, he would get super attacked. Um, yeah, uh, LR Gohan and LR Trunks are like two, the two OG LRs, and I don't have dupes for them. So, you never know. Maybe I'll get lucky on the uh, weekend tickets banner. Uh, as I'm sure you guys have heard me mention before, I am saving those for the last weekend uh, in case the banner is double rates, which is exactly what they did last time. So I definitely recommend that any of you out there do the same uh, if you haven't already used those tickets. So, hmm. Uh, right, so no super attack for Spirit Bomb Goku, but that's fine. I guess we'll just give him the three orbs so we can get a... Uh, Oh, actually, no, it doesn't even matter. I was going to say, the more orbs we give him, we get slightly more health. But I'm just going to go ahead and use a Sensu Bean. And then... Uh, we can't get a Super for you either, but let's grab this just to drop... Uh, we've got to start getting those in orbs down a little bit. See if we can start getting some 18 key Supers with uh, a Lava Geo. So... Spirit Bomb Goku getting super attacked. This is uh, the ideal unit on this rotation to get super attacked. So I'm not going to complain there. Only 45k. Almost a million attack stat for the in Ultima Gohan. That's pretty damn good considering he's uh, under double 100% leaders. And uh, he doesn't exactly have an ideal link partner on this rotation. So I'm going to set Gotenks free. And uh, he'll transform into the Boo Piccolo. Um, he's probably going to get... Yeah, he's going to like heal himself back to full. Um, but that's fine. So we'll grab this for you. And then Gohan can get those. So thanks to his passive, that will give him an 18 key super. And then Spirit Bomb Goku, let's give you those. Which, yeah, gives us a significant chunk of health back. That's exactly what we like to see. So... I wonder if we could get the transformation for Vegito. Because if we could get the transformation for Vegito um, to actually finish off the fight, that would be incredibly appropriate. Um, we can definitely go the turns. We just need to be on under 50% health at the right time. Because uh, with the lower leader skills, I definitely don't want to take risks when it comes to uh, taking attacks. But as you can see, the... Uh, Lower leader skill is meaning that our units are taking a little bit more damage than we would expect on uh, some of the category teams we would normally run them on. So, see, I, I would like to do this, but all those attacks at the back, not so good. I mean, one. Would this work? I mean, this wouldn't be the worst idea, I don't think. In fact, let us... Okay, I'm going to... Do I want to use this or this? Let's use this, because this doesn't help us out for super attacks, but it does increase our defense. So... 
if we take a super attack at any point in the turn, we should still survive, and then that means we can potentially get the Vegito transformation, so... See how we can uh, get on here. <laughs> Just keeps healing himself back to full after I uh, hit him, so... So yeah, how much will you take with a Android 8 active? I'm sure at this rate he's going to be the one that gets super attacks. But hey, he gets an additional super. So looking forward to his awakening. He becomes a 120% leader for the Goku family. So that'll be a nice sub leader for Battlefield. Especially if you do pull the LR um, Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Wow, yeah, every, everyone's taking very little damage with that item active. But now we're getting a super, which is hopefully... The Android 8 upping your defense doesn't really help you out much against super attacks. But as you can see, our HP more than high enough that that is unfortunately not quite enough. So... Uh... I guess we should do this just because of the defense. But I'll grab those. And wow, Goku. We can actually get a super attack for the uh, STR Goku. So um, I'm going to use this because hopefully, because this will last for two turns, maybe we can actually get back around to having <laughs> Vegito back on rotation and actually transform. But. I how much this is going to do to them, because they have pretty good defense. Yeah, 45 damage with the uh, Icarus active. That's crazy. Hey, and they managed to get an additional super as well. So, nicely making up for the fact that we couldn't get enough key. And they even uh, sealed the deal with a crit as well. So, LR Vegito putting in work. I need one more copy to rainbow them. So obviously very much hoping to get that copy on the Goku banner. I still need like three copies of Gogeta though. So I'm really hoping I can get a couple of extra copies of Gogeta. And uh, not pull too many copies of the LR Vegito. Being that obviously I don't need any more than one. So Okay let's do this. Um, in fact, I'm only going to get one orb with this Goku just because I don't want to heal too much. Um, and then, yeah, we might as well give you those. We'll let you get a super attack. Why not? So, because, yeah, the Icarus is still active. So, I'm, I'm kind of hoping that he will super attack the Kaioken Goku at the end. Because, obviously, despite being rainbowed, he is only a UR. Uh, he doesn't have a TUR form yet. So if he gets super attacked, even with the decent stats and the Icarus active, we should hopefully drop below 50%. Uh, here we go. Come on, Boo. Do a decent amount of damage to me so I can uh, finish you off with Fujito. Uh Is that 50%? It's just above, isn't it? I mean, it really shows you how, like, but we've been kind of complaining about it since the uh, units first came out. But it really shows you how, like, annoying the uh, six turns and then under 50% transformation restriction really is. Because, like, we're on a team with only 100% leaders. I'm trying to, I mean, obviously we have been using defensive items, but I'm trying to put people, like, in spots where they will get hit. And uh, we're still not able to force the transformation, so that is uh, that is pretty crazy. So I, feel, I feel like we probably are going to take him out before <laughs> without actually getting to see Vegito. I guess in theory, considering the uh, way the saga ends, I guess I could have just bought a Vegito unit, but... It seemed uh, like a very appropriate theme team to actually use this LR since obviously they do fight Boo as separate beings um, as well. So it seemed like it would be a nice uh, thematic kind of thing. So, um, okay, let's see. So we know that Gohan gives himself extra key anyway, so we can give you those and you'll be okay. Um, I'll give you those. So this is risky because that Goku at the end could uh, 
definitely mess this all up for us but I really don't want to use like a princess snake because if no one gets super attacked at all then we just won't take any oh and of course we're going to get the Dokon attack okay well I guess it's uh, GG for you boo this is the way uh, a lot of people hoped that the saga would have ended with uh, Ultimate Gohan taking out Super Boo. So, there you go. We literally could not get the uh, LR Vegito transformation despite trying to force it. And uh, Gohan here, going to take him out. I do like this Super Attack animation for this Gohan. Oh, wow. Okay, he doesn't take him out. Even more appropriate for the series. So, <laughs> all but Gohan fails. And uh, Goku with the Spirit Bomb has to come in to uh, actually finish him off. So, an incredibly appropriate ending to the uh, Dragon Ball Z theme of the video. So, there you go. But, anyway. That is going to be it for the video, guys. This has been the Master Ningen. As I've said before in the other theme team battles, feel free to leave your suggestions for theme teams that you would like to see in the comments below. I always try and get those done if I can make a team that will work around your suggestion. Um, you guys can see over the theme team battles I've done the last couple of days, um, the Gohan and Goten one was suggested in the comment section. So if you have an idea, let me know and I will see what I can do. So smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you are new. You can follow my Twitch channel or join my Discord. The link is in the description below. And I will see you all again soon. Have a good one.